Okay, so this lady was tying her cat up at the staircase so the cat wouldn't run away. This is obviously dangerous as the cat could fall off the stairwell and get caught up in her leash, which would obviously injure the cat. For this reason, this gentleman called this lady out and told her to untie the cat, which set this Karen off when she decided to confront him and tell him to leave her area immediately, claiming that he's not even allowed to be there. The gentleman tried to defend himself, which obviously upset this Karen even more, and she even claims that he's not allowed to upset her as she's 71 and he should have better things to do. Regardless though, this gentleman is in the right as what she was doing was quite dangerous and he was just looking out for her pet. Let's have a look. I'm allowed to be here. You got nothing to do with it. You're not allowed you got to be nothing here. to do with it's it. Forever, Why don't you get back in your and apartment? I'm 71 and you shouldn't be upsetting us older people all the I'm time. I'm not upsetting you. You are. You're tying your cat on You're the staircase. You're tying your cat. You're always nagging and picking on everybody. You're tying your cat on the staircase. All you do is nagging and picking on everybody. Oh, get it on the tape. I will. Go report to housing. I will. Oh, you I'll come here and, about you. You come here and harass me. You know, I had a drunk living there with and you. And you've got a drunk living down and below you know me. What? And you're a drinker. You're, you're the worst. Your cat everywhere. It doesn't. It does. I just washed it off today. On the, off the, that wasn't my cat. That's your cat. That tied up there. That was not my cat. That was not my cat. I know where my cat is. And firstly, I asked you nicely about the cat. You started yeah, yelling well, at me. Yeah, you didn't ask me nicely this afternoon, did you? Yes, you, I did. You automatically went, Oh, your cat's on the stairs. They're very dangerous. And I said it nicely. Grow up! Go away. You're too young to be old! Mental case. Grow up! Go away. Okay, so this gentleman was closing up his restaurant and noticed that people that weren't even customers at this restaurant decided to get some food and sit down on his tables and chairs to eat the food. For this reason, he asked them to get off the chairs as they weren't paying customers and he was closing up shop. These entitled people were very offended that he would ask them to get up though and decided to give this guy a very hard time or because he wanted to close up his shop. These entitled Karens couldn't understand that they weren't even sitting down at this restaurant and this gentleman had nothing to do with the food they had or the inconvenience that would go through because they were eating at some Somebody else's store. So let's have a look. That's yeah, you know, I asked you nicely to leave. That's about it. I asked you nicely to leave. Okay, well done. Yes, sir. Thank you. Go ahead. Oh yeah, I'm over here. What are you gonna do? Go ahead. Go ahead. Keep saying what you need to say, sir. Keep saying what you need to say. Keep saying what you need to say. That's what I say. I'm asking you nicely, bro. I'm asking you nicely. Okay. You're no ball, so go ahead. Right here. You don't tell me. You ain't no ball. I asked you nicely. You know, I asked you nicely. We're trying to, we're trying to close. Bro, honestly, there's benches around the corner. It's not that hard, honestly. It's a bald man. They're all bald. They're bald. the address is 24 East. 24 East. East 2nd Ave. East 2nd Ave. Delray Beach. One of them is wearing... Look at you, Dave. Okay, so this Karen had some serious road rage. Basically, she wasn't happy with the driver next to her and sped up to flag the driver down so that the Karen could match his speed and abuse him. This Karen starts threatening these girls, wishing diseases on them and even mocking them for their appearance while she was literally driving her car and not looking at the road. That's right, this Karen is literally driving down the road, not even looking at the road so that she can abuse these girls. Let's have a look. Okay, so a serious road rage incident took place when this driver crashed his car. The lady and gentleman got out to exchange anything but their insurance information when they tried to get physical instead. That's right, the confrontation turned ugly real quick when they got into each other's faces and started screaming and abusing at each other about who was in the wrong. That's when this lady went to call the authorities and the gentleman stated that she shouldn't as he believes he was a gangster and it would be detrimental to get the authorities involved, which somehow turned out in his favor. Let's have a look. I'm not ready! I don't give a no. You have PTSD! I don't give a what you have! Get out of my car! I'm not gonna your car! You just f***ed up my truck! Okay! I can't go nowhere! Relax! You relax! Yeah, why you run? Why run? Why you run? Why? Because I'm a gangster! I don't f***ing ask you to my f***ing Hey, that's why you call the cops! 
case, this male Karen was being a really tough customer at this subway, and when his sub was made, he demanded that she put the sub back into the oven for another two seconds. This Karen started belittling the employee, calling her an idiot, among other things, and just abusing her for not assuming what he wanted on his sandwich. This is one of the worst customers I have ever seen, and this Karen wasn't happy with how long it took him to get his sub, so he started abusing this employee for this reason. This Karen called her stupid, questioned her intelligence, and when he realized he was being recorded, he walked up to the girl who was recording him and slapped her phone out of her hands. Let's have a look. And your man. Can so I please ahead, have a six Get my foot. face. My name is. You can Google me. You can Spotify me. Instagram me. I would slap this lady if she touches me again. Point blank, period. And that's exactly how it's going to go. Okay. Tell her to keep, her, keep my name. Excuse me, sir. I'm trying to, to order my sandwich. Oh, okay, please? we have a problem. Okay, so a Karen couple were outside of a shop and one of the Karens started threatening another shopper and getting in his face and very aggressive. The male Karen loses it and starts threatening this completely random person and his girlfriend starts screaming and has to pull him away. Things escalate quickly and they get in each other's faces. I had to blur some stuff out here, but basically they're screaming at the top of their lungs towards each other and getting very confrontational. This male Karen refused to back down and then even brought out his phone to take pictures of everybody around him and then this Karen claims that she's calling the police on everybody while screaming at the top of her lungs to them as well. Let's have a look. Be on your own one. You make me. Stop it! You make me. Make me. Go home. Go home, man. Go home. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Don't touch me. Go. Don't touch me. Go. No, I don't have to because this. Thanks for watching guys and if you've enjoyed this episode please subscribe to the channel and turn notifications on